Hey everybody, I'm Steve with my first unboxing video. And what better way to start out with than the <sighs> Oculus Rift. I just got this today and I was order 21,266. So it did take a really long time. And yes, there are plenty of other unboxing videos. But this is a product I've been really excited about. I've been reading the articles, watching demo videos, and I couldn't wait for it. And I just wanted to join the developer community. And what better way to start to at least provide information for you guys if you haven't seen other unboxing videos, or at least try to provide more information. So, let's get started. Alright, well I'm dying to open this thing, but before I do, uh, I'm just going to answer some frequently asked questions that I often see in the comments of other videos that I just wanted to answer. Uh, first off, how much is this thing? The developer kit costs $300 online. You can go to uh, oculusvr.com and uh, order it and it'll ship to you. Um, when does the consumer model come out? That's unknown. It's speculated to be around 2014. Could be the edge of 2015, depending on how development goes. How much is the consumer model going to cost? Also unknown. With advancing technology and more support, it you know potentially be cheaper. Um, I'm thinking it will still be around the $300 range. It could go up to $400, but I don't think it's going to go any more than that. Let's open it. Start with the uh, most important piece here. It is the actual headset itself? It has. Uh, they added a uh, supporting strap that will go top of your head to uh, hold hold the extra weight. And and here is where the cups go. And. Right here is a little adjustment knob in which you can bring the screen closer and further depending on your vision and uh, basically based off your preference. Yes, you can wear glasses with these uh, with minor adjustments to the headset. You can wear them just fine and they should cover pretty much all ranges of eyesight with the, with the cups. Uh, the screen is 1280 by 800 which is a good size, but keep in mind that that's between two screens, one for each eye. So that's going to be about uh, 640 by 800, and the resolution will be bumped up um, much higher in the actual develop, um, the consumer model. And here's the uh, control box, which this is where it's plugged in. Uh, for power and you can turn on and off the headset you have the USB you can plug it in uh, with DVI and you can also plug it in with HDMI and those cables are right here they give you all the cables you need two HDMI's one is three foot one is six foot and they also have an adapter HDMI to DVI here are the three cups. One of the cups is already in here. And they have uh, two extras. It's considered A cup, B cup, C cup, depending on your vision. Uh, I think A is for highest clarity of vision. The other two are for uh, lower, lower vision. You have all sorts of adapters, because these shipped all over the world. So these are for any kind of plug you need. One last thing, 
The Oculus does not work with consoles at the moment. It only works for PC with both Windows and Mac operating system. And that's about it. I'm going to be doing plenty of testing, and in a couple weeks, I'll try to give my review on it. Thanks.